Hello, guys, and welcome back to Earl Sports Bets. I'm Timothy Earl, and today we've got another free pick video. This one's going to be a little bit different. It's the ACC tournament uh, starting, I believe, what, Monday? Uh, I could be wrong. I think it's either Monday or Tuesday. That's going to be starting up a uh, Wednesday. It's starting up Wednesday. There we go. I know my stuff. Um, no, but uh, we have a little bit of a bracket situation. We're going to go over who we think is going to be moving on, um, who is going to win each game. It's going to be kind of our predictive thing based on our power rankings at the moment. Uh, obviously, all of this is subject to change. But if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, share, do all that good stuff. We appreciate all the support. Check out all the links in the description below, Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, Discord, Facebook, Picks and Parlays, Premium Plays, Merch, TikTok, the EarlSportsBets.com website. Uh, and the ESP shorts all linked down in the description down below. Uh, we have it typed up here a little bit. Uh, maybe I should zoom out just a tad uh, so you guys can see it more. Uh, so we have the opening rounds right here, uh, 12, 11, 10, all these. And then they'll eventually go through here and get to, to the champion down here. Uh, it's the easiest way for us to go and fill out brackets and stuff uh, that way. So we kind of created it this way through Google Sheets. Um, uh, so, uh, that's how we're going to be running it for this one. We'll go ahead and start off the opening matchups. Uh, Pittsburgh is at Boston, is versus Boston College. These are all neutral site games. I believe this is in New York. Uh, I believe it's an MSG. Uh, if I'm remember, no, that was the Big East. I don't remember where this is. Um, we'll start off. Pittsburgh is against Boston College, uh, the 12 versus 13. And for this one, uh, According to our power rankings, we have Boston College at a 2.3 and Pittsburgh at a one uh, at a 0.7. So we like Boston College to move on in this one. Uh, we have them winning by the slightest margin. This one's going to be a close game. Obviously, we don't have any spreads out for this one, uh, but we would have this Boston College as a one and a half point favorite uh, in this one. So we have Boston College beating Pittsburgh. Clemson is going up against NC State. Uh, Clemson 10 seed, NC State 15. And this one was pretty easy for us. We have Clemson around a 9. We have NC State at a 4.2. So we have this one around a 5-point victory for Clemson. So we're going to have Clemson moving on uh, to face off against Virginia Tech. Uh, Louisville will be facing off against Georgia Tech, the defending ACC champions. Uh, but the defending ACC champions are going to go out in the first round because we have Louisville winning this game by around two points. Uh, so we like Louisville in that one, which will bring us up to this one, which Florida State and Syracuse. Uh, and this one's going to be the closest one that we've had, that we're going to have in the entire tournament. We have Syracuse as a point. Oop, I didn't mean to do that one. As a 0.1 point win, if that makes sense. We have them at power rank at an 8.4, Florida State at an 8.3. We're going to be taking Syracuse to beat Florida State by the slightest of margins. All right, so we'll have them end up going up against Duke next. Um, but Boston College is going to go up against Wake Forest in the second round. And this one is... Pretty simple for us. We have this one uh, as the one of the widest margin games. Uh, we have Wake Forest winning this game by about 10 points. Boston College isn't that good. Wake Forest is actually a halfway decent team. So we have Wake Forest moving on to face off against Miami in the third round. Clemson versus Virginia Tech uh, is the next game. And we have, we have Virginia Tech moving on. Um, we have them winning by about four and a half points. So we like the Virginia Tech Hokies uh, to go to the third round and face off against the Northern Dame Irish, Fighting Irish. Um, 11 versus 6 is Louisville and Virginia. Uh, we have Virginia winning this game. Uh, we have them winning by around 4-ish uh, points, 4, almost 5 points in this game. So we do like Virginia to move on to the third round to face off against the Tar Heels. On to the top game, number one, Duke will be facing Syracuse. And here is where Duke starts to make a little bit of a run. Uh, we have them beating Syracuse by around 11 points, 11, 10 and a half point area. Uh, uh, we have 
Duke, Duke is one of our higher ranked teams uh, in college basketball in general. We just think that this one's probably not going to be close. Even though Syracuse really needs to win that game in order to really have a shot at the to- at making the tournament, uh, Duke's going to be too much for them to handle. Uh, Miami will be facing off against Wake Forest. And uh, we're going to have a little bit of an upset. We do like Wake Forest in this game. Uh, we have them winning this one by around two and a half, three point area. Um, we have Wake Forest at a 12.2. We have Miami at a 9.6. So Wake Forest to make it to the quarterfinals versus, uh, versus Duke. How about another upset? Number seven seed. Uh, Virginia Tech versus Northern Dame, and we like Virginia Tech uh, by winning, to win this game by, by about two and a half points uh, currently. We have them as a higher-ranked team. This is a good Virginia Tech team. They're going to play good defensively, and uh, we think that they're going to outdo uh, Northern Dame by about two, two and a half point area. So we're taking Virginia Tech to upset Northern Dame. Uh, UNC is going to go up against uh, Virginia in the following round. Uh, and we have UNC winning this game by about three and a half points uh, over Virginia. Uh, UNC coming off a big win against Duke. I think this is a good spot for uh, UNC to at least win one game. Um, pretty much locks them into the uh, bracket. Uh, pretty sure they're pretty much locked in at this point anyways. But um, Virginia, uh, North Carolina to beat Virginia Tech. First team to make the uh, ACC championship game will be the Duke Blue Devils. Uh, and this one shouldn't really be close. Duke should win this game by at least 7 to 10 points. Um, I, we like Duke to uh, get the job done versus Wake Forest. How about another upset? We like Virginia Tech to take out North Carolina. Uh, this is the slightest of margins. We have Virginia Tech at a 13.4. UNC at a 13.2, so it's a 0.2 point difference. That's going to get Virginia Tech into that ACC championship game. But, but, but we have Duke winning it all. I uh, And it's the fact that Duke's six points better than everybody else in this conference. Uh, this is Duke's ACC championship to lose. And uh, I think they're going to go all the way. And I don't think they're really going to have that much of a problem throughout this entire bracket. So we're taking the Duke Blue Devils to defeat Virginia Tech in the ACC championship game. This is our complete uh, ACC bracket for this year. Uh, Let me know what you guys think of it uh, in the comments section down below. I want to thank you guys all for watching. And until next time, let's make some money. Let's cash some bets in the ACC championship uh, tournament. Good luck to everybody.